Hey everyone, Mr. Sujano here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to import your PS2 game saves on PCSX2 and EtherSX2. Let's get started. All right, to kick things off, to import your PS2 save files, you're going to need four different things. The first thing here are your save files, and they can be in something like a .max format or .cbs. The second thing you're going to need is MYMC. I'll leave a link to this in the description below. The third thing you'll need here are two DLL files in order for MYMC to work. And I'll drop a link to this in the description below as well. And the last thing you're going to need here is PCSX2. And yes, this is required if you are using EtherSX2. Again, I'll drop a link to this in the description below. And just an added note here, for this entire process to work, you will need to provide your own PS2 BIOS file. If you're already using a BIOS file with EtherSX2, well, you can use that for PCSX2. There's no issue there. If you don't know what a PS2 BIOS file is, I recommend searching Google because there's a lot of great information there. Once you've got everything downloaded, feel free to set up PCSX2 and also extract MYMC and MSV into the exact same folder. Here is what the MYMC folder should look like after you've extracted everything. We can see the two DLLs in here. Now to double check to make sure you've done everything correctly so far, double click on MYMC-GUI and open it just to make sure it opens. If everything opens, great, you're on the right track, click cancel here and exit out of MYMC. Next up, open up PCSX2, go to config and memory cards, and you should have a couple of memory cards in here by default. If you don't have anything in here, click create and make an eight megabyte memory card. Make sure to name it MCD001, that just makes life a lot easier. Now, if you take a look at my screen under formatted, both cards say no. We are gonna have to format these cards in order for them to work with MYMC, so just click cancel here. Go to CDVD and then click No Disk. Then go to System and click Boot BIOS. Now for this video, I'm using BIOS SCPH39001. From here, go into Browser. Now this screen brings back some terrible memories when my PS2 decided not to load a disk, which happened quite a bit. Then select Memory Card 1. It says Unformatted. Format now, select Yes. When it says Format and Complete, you're pretty much good to go here on PCSX2. If you want to format the secondary memory card, you absolutely can, but you don't have to. When you're all done there, close out of PCSX2, go back to MYMC-GUI and open that up. From here, navigate to where your memory cards are located. By default, they should be in PCSX2 and MEM cards, and they're probably hidden in my documents. And then select MCD001.PS2. From here, click Import. That's the icon with the green arrow. Next, select your Save File or Save Files. And if you've done everything correctly so far, you should see the save file in this list. From here, you're pretty much done. Feel free to close MYMC. To verify everything is correct, you can open up PCSX2, click System here, and boot up your BIOS again. If you go back into the browser here, select your memory card, you should now see the save file in here. Now, if you're only here for PCSX2, you are watching. 100% done. Go on ahead and enjoy your save games. If you're here for EtherSX2, we have a couple of more steps. The first step is to navigate to the mem cards folder in your PCSX2 folder. From here, you want to grab mcd001.ps2 and transfer that to your phone. Once the file's on your phone, open up EtherSX2 and then click on the hamburger menu. From here, select Import Memory Card. And from here, navigate to where you place that memory card on your phone and select it. You should get a message that says Import Memory Card. Select which slot to import this memory card to or cancel. Any saves in the selected slot will be slot. Uh, please double check before continuing. You have two options, well three options here. Cancel is one of them. You can select slot one, or if you have saves in progress already, just select slot two. For this video, I'm selecting slot one. If you've done everything correctly so far, you should get a little message on the bottom that says everything was successful. From here, go to Start BIOS just to double check to make sure everything's okay. And just like on PCSX2, from here select Browser. And then select Memory Card 1 or Memory Card 2 depending where you put your save games and you should see them right here. But anyways, that is all I've got for this video. Let me know your thoughts about EtherSX2 in the comments below. Let me know your thoughts about PCSX2 in the comments below. And let me know what games you plan on importing game saves for in the comments below. If you like this video, leave a like. If you didn't like this video, leave a like. Hit that subscribe button, check out my other videos. Thank you everyone, take care.